Hey Zoo fans, today we're going to go over how to set up and maintain the Turtle Clean 318. The 318 is a fully submersible filter that can help maintain clean water in aquatic turtle and fish tanks. This filter combines mechanical, chemical, and biological filtration to efficiently clean up to 15 gallons of water. Setting up this filter is easy. First, remove the black cover on the bottom of the filter and take out the white filter cartridge. Be sure to hold it by the small finger tab. Locate the three holes on the back of the filter and insert the included suction cups. The best way to do this is by simultaneously pressing and twisting the suction cups. Once the suction cups are in place, open the empty side of the white filter cartridge and fill it with the included packet of activated carbon. Briefly rinse the cartridge under running water to remove any dust from the carbon, and then slide the cartridge back into the filter. Be sure that the rounded side of the cartridge lines up with the groove of the filter and the finger tab is accessible. And lastly, close the filter with the black cap. If you need to adjust the flow of the filter, you can rotate the valve by twisting the nozzle to either the minimum or maximum outputs. You can also attach the included water diverter to the nozzle to help direct water flow. Now you're ready to install the filter in your tank. Use the suction cups to secure the filter to the side or bottom of the tank. The Turtle Clean 318 should be placed completely underwater to function properly. For especially shallow tanks, it can be placed on the bottom of the tank with the nozzle pointed upwards. For safety purposes, it's important to incorporate a drip loop. Do this by letting the power cord drop below the height of the power outlet. The 318 filter will need to be cleaned at least once a month. In order to clean the filter, make sure to first unplug it from its power source and remove it from the tank. Next, remove the black cap, take out the long sponge, and rinse it in warm water. Place it back into the filter when you're finished. Now, remove the white filter cartridge and open the compartments. Replace the used carbon with new and rinse the short sponge with dechlorinated water. Dechlorinated water allows for beneficial bacteria to remain in the short sponge and aid in biological filtration. Place the short sponge back into the filter cartridge, close the compartments, and place back into the filter. To maintain filter efficiency, the pump will occasionally need to be cleaned. To do this, remove the filter from the pump housing by slightly tilting it towards the nozzle and pulling. Pull the impeller straight out of the chamber. Carefully rinse all parts under running water, cleaning with a non-metallic brush where necessary. Reassemble the filter by placing the impeller back into the chamber and attaching the filter cartridge to the pump housing. The filter is now clean and can be reinstalled into the tank. That's all for now. See you next time.